Good afternoon, it's Monday the 9th of February. Just a quick look now at the week ahead in terms of economic announcements and equity reports. So it's a, a calmer start to the week as well as uh, a calm finish as well in terms of macroeconomic releases. Uh, Tuesday and Thursday are fairly busy uh, with UK, US and China all releasing potentially significant monthly figures. Uh, we're nearing the end of Q4 2014 earnings season in the equity space but there's still some heavy lifters due to report um, throughout the week. So uh, Tuesday, tomorrow, 1.30 GMT, we have Chinese CPI data. Uh, the figures for December in comparison showed a year-on-year -year increase of 1.5%, slightly above November's 1.4% year-on-year increase. The uh, question is, will January see a further rise um, or a fall instead? Coca-Cola reporting in the morning as well. Uh, Wednesday, much busier day, 10.30 GMT, we have the Bank of England quarterly inflation report um, and press conference. Mark Carney saying previously that timidity amongst policymakers is really the key to stagnation in the Eurozone at the moment. Um, so he could take this opportunity to, to move decisively on interest rates or will uh, the Bank of England hold off for the time being? We will, we will see. AOL, Badu, Racket Bankaiser, Tesla, Thomson Reuters and Time Warner all due to release quarterly earnings statements on Wednesday. Thursday, 1.30, US retail sales, um, GMT. So um, US retail sales fell 0.9% in December. Um, question is, will we see a further drop in January or, uh, or will the decline be reversed? CBS, Commerce Bank and Credit Suisse all reporting Thursday afternoon. And Friday the 13th, we have nothing too significant in terms of economic announcements, but we do have Rolls-Royce, Tyson Krupp and ArcelorMittal reporting their 2014 quarterly earnings statements. That's the week ahead. Thank you.